hey 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 guys welcome welcome back to my channel listen i am so curious about getting to this product that i did not even say hey guys i didn't even wave by like wave at you all but hey um i guess we're gonna get right into this video do not forget to like subscribe share and definitely leave a comment down below so right now i'm giving you all a 360 of my hair that has already been prepped for styling if you want to see a dedicated video showing you how i moisturize my hair for every hairstyle i do leave a comment below and definitely like thumbs up this bed okay so right now i am sectioning my hair to how i want my wash and go to lay i'm gonna do a side part and of course i'm finger detangling any tangles that may arise so I'm going to get that um, line straight I'm very like nitpicky about clean lines uh oh get the shed ahead off girl I'm very very picky about how clean my lines are I feel like this is a lost art the 90s knew about it these late these current 2000s honey mm, I don't know if parts still matter but in my world they still do so I'm cleaning up my part section in my hair. I'm usually accustomed showing us how clean it is. I'm usually accustomed to like the middle part, but I wanted to do a side part this time. So I'm twisting it away, and I like to work in sections because um, it helps me to better manage my hair, and plus it makes you way more organized, and you don't feel as overwhelmed when all your hair is out all at once. My hair is curly and thick and when it's all out i low-key do feel anxiety <laughs> but once i have it in sections using my um uh i think they call these i don't know clamp clip the clip um i'm good to go so this is this is like legit my first time i'm actually breaking the seal on camera so you guys can see that i bought that that day and Okay, come on, let's get it, come on, get it, get it, boom. So I'm smelling it, and it smells like fragrance, which I'm not a fan of, like, it smells like perfume, you know, like perfume, like smelling stuff, like, it smells chemically. Um, yeah, it's super chemically, but I was still excited to go forward with it. I mean, we got this far, right? And if you're a natural, Lisa, if, like, if you're an actual natural hair girl, you know, once you prep your hair for hairstyle, you cannot be trying to change your mind. Like, listen, we are, we're gonna go through with it, and if we don't like it, we'll wash it out the following week. So I'm prepping right now with some water. Wash and goes are easier when you have water to help aid with the distribution of the gel. Again, my hair is already my hair is already prepped. It has my leave-in, my oil, and my cream moisturizer. So we're good to go. I'm feeling it, it's very thick. It smells like fragrance, but it's very thick. The consistency was very thick and low-key sticky, in my opinion. Like, I knew that it would hold. And I'm like, I can tell because my, my curls were feeling defined already as I was raking yeah, uh-huh, yeah, uh-huh. As I was raking through my hair, I could feel the gel difference versus when my hair did not have in it, have it in it. Did not have it on it, pardon. Uh, yeah, uh-huh, take it in, gosh, y'all, take it in, girl. Yeah, I was really, really excited to see the end results. I really wanted to see if it could actually hold my curls for me. And again, I'm not doing any manipulation. I'm just raking the gel through. I'm not finger coiling. I'm not clumping. I'm just gonna let it do my natural finger detangle. Just do its thing. And I don't like to um, detangle my hair with a comb if I'm gonna do like a wash and go. I actually like to just finger detangle my hair through my whole entire wash day process because I feel like once you comb or brush your hair 
with the dim dimming brush it like you know it breaks up all your curls so it makes this faux curl and I like my natural curls over what the dimming brush does for my hair so right now you're seeing my natural curls come to um, life in a sense they're being really really defined and I'm making sure I'm coating, coating my hair well as this is going to last me the whole week I am not the natural that likes to be in her hair all the time I like to style my hair once a week and keep it moving now I'm showing you guys what I'm getting thus far and you can see my curls like you can they're very loose right now but you can see them like I can see them like my hair was actually getting defined by a second So you guys got to see me do one section nice and slow and I'm gonna speed up <laughs> so character. I'm gonna speed up the video so you're probably wondering why I never really use eco style gel well I did find another gel which I do have a review on my channel go check it out so once I found that gel and loved it I didn't find a need to try the eco style gel plus I'm the person that does not like to always go with the overrated or the crowd's favorite product or any you know opinion or statement I like to like do things and try things in my own lane my own vein so I intentionally was like uh I like my own gel I don't have to go buy out the eco style gel gel to try it out and plus I'm not a product junkie once I find what I like and works for my hair I'm so there's no need for me to like branch out until my hair gets sick of it and I do have to like find something else so my hair can like readapt but besides that that's the reason why it took me six plus years to finally 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 try out eco style gel Right now, I'm showing you all a side-by-side -side comparison of my hair with the Eco Style Gel versus my hair without it. So you all can see how one side is definitely defined and the other is her natural self. Okay, so I did the other side of my head off camera just to save time. And right now, I am showing you guys the last section again. Getting some gel and breaking it through. When you um, do this, it's very important to, again, take your time and finger detangle the product through. You want to make sure your hair is evenly coated throughout. I was being, I was being very mindful that I, I did not get the gel um, on my scalp because my scalp, she is such a diva, okay? She likes what she likes, and she doesn't what she doesn't, and I wanted to ensure that um, she was not going to be agitated in any type of way. So if you see me not really getting my roots, that's why. Getting my little baby hairs on the side. I call those my islands because <laughs> they don't connect to anything else. But my but my hair is clearly thriving in that section. So I call it my islands. And I'm getting it through. Coat, coat, coat. Making sure my part is nicely coated. Because this is the front of my head, so I gotta make sure I gotta make sure I'm, I am definitely thorough. Okay. All right, all right. Working it through, working it through. Excited about it. Look at my hang time. Hey. Look at my hang time. Hey. Okay, y'all. So these next. I'm going to show you how my hair looked after I was done applying the Eco Style Gel. I was so excited. I had to, you know, take some selfies. You know, this was going to be cute and I could already tell. <laughs> so, okay, at this point, I already slicked down my edges separately off cam. And right now, I'm just going to use my big old silk wrap. And I'm going to use that to protect my hair as it dries. I know clearly it's gonna take a minute to dry, but I still wanted to ensure that I was good for the next day. And this is real life. Next time, next day, I was going to church today, and it was 
literally my hair I was done with my hair like three o'clock in the morning so I knew my hair was nowhere dry y'all nowhere dry but I was still excited to see it okay Ooh, ow obviously when you sleep your curls will clump and I know this that's why I started shaking my head to naturally just break the curls apart it's just looking good sis okay and right now I'm touching up because I know that again my curls are like flattened so I'm going to add some water and you know mess around a little bit with it just to freshen it up pull it apart spritz 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 and it's looking good already it's looking really really good I was really excited I like this look it was like a wet wavy out the shower for a black girl look and I liked it I like the yellow okay my curls y'all look at them wow remember y'all I was just raking the gel through no manipulation super super excited checking the back making sure you know it's not um, flat or clump so these are some selfies I took after I came back from church and listen you <laughs> if the pictures don't tell you y'all I loved it it was so cute and so different for me I never really have my hair out or down like this so I was listening y'all taking a full advantage of it this was um, after um, I came home and it was drying look how to find it look look at that y'all this is a week old and obviously you know it's a little dry it's been like six seven days but it actually lasted the whole entire time which I was happy all I had to do was mist it a little bit and you know touch up my edges but it was it was just time for wash day as you can see crusted and busted but I enjoyed it for the week all right all right y'all if you all enjoyed this video like I did do not forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment, and definitely share. Do not also forget to turn on your notifications so whenever I drop new content, you will be alerted. Girl, come on now. It's your cute self. Until next time, it's your favorite Christian lifestyle blogger, Lasho Sela. Bye. <laughs> to see my complete look, do not forget to follow me on Instagram on my fashion and style page at Rachel Silla Styles. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social media accounts. See you there.